Hi everyone, uh, thought I'd uh, do another live stream at the moment whilst I'm cooking my uh, tea about what's been going on since I took my calf show this morning. Uh, interesting. Um, I've started already feeling the effects of the calf show. Uh, started feeling the effects about three, four o'clock this afternoon. And the effects have included um, my sinuses and my lungs basically clearing themselves out. Um, so I can actually feel the stuff moving up or wherever. Um, and this actually does take me back to the side, the point, the effects of or can be when I started that back in January two thousand and seventeen. Um, and anyone with CF or uh, has had a chest infection where they get like that odd taste in the mouth um, when they're basically coughing up stuff, um, you'll know what I mean when I say I can actually taste that, That's um, uh, which goes to show how much this stuff is working. Probably too much information for some of you, but if you're eating your tea at this time, but hey, it, at the end of the day, we all produce it, don't we? Um, we just don't really talk about it. So, yeah, I've started feeling the effects on my lungs, uh, like movements and all that, and in my sinuses. And uh, I'm going to just turn me. Right. And. Um, they don't look too bad actually. And uh, oh, that's hot. So, <clears throat> yeah, so it's all heading in the right direction. On the way home from work, I dropped off at the pharmacy. Uh, and <clears throat> as I got out of my car, I felt a little dizzy, which is another side effect that I was to expect in the first two weeks of taking this treatment and um, and it does say that if I do get that feeling of dizziness uh, basically not to drive or operate um, machinery so I was planning to go to the gym tonight uh, or do something um, but um, obviously the pharmacy I had to go there first to collect stuff and it's just as well I did that and not go straight to the gym, otherwise I'd been stuck. Um, so I'm being sensible and staying at home and relaxing a little bit. Um, <clears throat> so that is as expected, I suppose. Um, but I suppose a part of me didn't expect that. Uh, so I guess what that tells me is how powerful this treatment is. I think Bessie just waved at me, or is that telling me to wave at her? I'll wave at her, whatever. Anyway, um, so yeah, I'm just burning my tea now. Because <laughs> I'm too busy talking to you lot while trying to get this sorted. Uh, so yeah, onwards and upwards now. So let's see how this goes um, over the next couple of days. But I should think it will go, it will just, if anything, get better and better and better. And since, also since this morning, um, someone else had with cystic fibrosis started this treatment five days ago. Um, and he put some message of some description on Facebook. And I responded saying, I start mine today. And he said, um, you, that I will feel a huge difference in the next uh, few days in myself so I've got that to look forward to uh, in the meantime diet wise well I've adhered to what has, has been suggested and that is to cut down on the crap food which I've done-ish um, and uh, to cut down on how much you eat in a day, which uh, I started doing that anyway on Monday, knowing that any time this week I was going to receive the treatment. 
Um, so I'm doing, and not only am I doing rather well in that, uh, but I've also cut down on. Uh, uh, well, I cut out a habit where I've had, say, a massive breakfast, a small, well, a medium sized lunch, and then a normal evening meal. And what I've noticed is, is that because I've had the ma massive breakfast, even though I've had a lot to eat and then had my lunch, I start to feel hungry again, like really hungry between 3 and 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, and having to wait until either get home before I can eat or, or uh, go and hunt in the staff kitchen, which is a bit nasty because it's not always my food, I Nick. Nope, nope, they're not watching. Anyway, um, bit of a <laughs> anyway, um, so <clears throat> the last couple of days I've actually had uh, a nice balanced and uh, eaten less than my breakfast, had a normal lunch and uh, as a result of that I've not felt any kind of hunger until the right time, which is like around about this time. And not only have been, not only the benefit of not feeling hungry, but also I've actually um, slept better as well as a result. So that says a lot. If you can eat shit and eat loads of it at the wrong time and not control your portions, that's the effect it has on you. So yeah. So let's see how tonight goes. I've got my Viagra to take, uh, not Viagra, that's Chris Pratt's fault. Uh, my, what's it called? I forgot what it's called. Um, Clyde to take, which is uh, the little blue pill that I told you about this morning. Um, those who haven't seen this morning's video yet, whether it was live or since it was um, uploaded, um, Caftrio, it's actually, although it's one drug, it's two different tablets. So the first tablet I found in the morning is an orange tablet, which consists, which actually consists of three different drugs that have been combined into one. Uh, again, I can't remember the top of my head what those three different drugs are, um, and it's not easy to read either, so I'll probably pronounce it wrong. Um, but one of the three drugs that is in that tablet I have in the morning, I need to have another dose of that in the evening. So in the evening, I take one blue tablet. And that's where the Viagra joke came from, uh, from lovely Chris Platt. Um, thank you very much. And uh, <coughs> so I'll be having that um, after I've eaten this meal because again in case you didn't see see the video whether it was live this morning or since um, or can be and this new treatment Caftrio I have to take after I've had uh, a meal that has that consists of 20 grams of fat for it to work properly because the fat delays uh, just in case you don't know, when you uh, have something like a glass of water or something that's low in fat, because there's nothing in there for the body to digest, um, um, it basically just goes straight through uh, the digestive system into you know, wherever. Whereas <clears throat> the more fat, the fattier the food or um, the longer it stays in your stomach to die for your body to digest and absorb the nutrients. So if I was to take the tablet, uh, the, this, this new treatment with no food and just have a drink with it, uh, no matter the fat content of that drink, whether it's zero because it's water or a couple of grams of fat if it, uh, from it being milk, um, the <clears throat> result will be that the tablet won't stay in my stomach and my digestive system long enough for it to be absorbed by the body for it to work properly which is why I have to have a snack or a meal that has 20 grams of fat in it because 20 grams is sufficient enough for it to stay in the digestive system, digestive system long enough for the body to absorb it and for it to work properly. 
so there you go. <coughs> so <coughs> basically I see it as an excuse to eat. <laughs> um, but that's part of how that's part of what I have to do to for it to work properly. Um, so uh, two of the f side effects which caught my eye, which I thought was interesting and hopefully won't happen during this time, is that I will get either a common cold kind of effect or the effects of the flu. And as you all are aware that the common cold or flu symptoms are also coronavirus symptoms uh, and now because I keep myself safe so I have a mask with me when I go out if I need to wear it such as in the shop or at the gym um, and that I social distance whether I'm out and about doing whatever or working um, I know in myself that if I do have these symptoms the flu or cold symptoms that it's not coronavirus because there's a lot of a lot of other things that happen if it is such as you lose your sense of smell and taste um, and one way I will be able to identify that is that this treatment actually increases your sense of smell and taste so um, basically I'd be going in the opposite direction to coronavirus so that's a, another small fact that I thought you'd be interested in knowing uh, <clears throat> but if anything, if this goes the way I think it will go, in the same way as or can be did in 2017, I think the effects I will have is simply my sinuses clearing up, my lungs clearing up, um, and hopefully this dizzy spell is just uh, just a coincidence, but. I'm not too many chances, I'm not going to drive or operate machinery until tomorrow morning, to, tomorrow morning that is, when I go to work. So, right, well, I'm hungry. My onion rings are black, oops, but that's how I like them. Um, and to make the onion, onion rings look healthy, I've got some fresh veg done. And if, and if you want, if you really want to know what I'm having for my tea, it's the sos three sos sausage patties, hash browns, onion rings, and to make it healthy, I've got a mix of veg of cabbage, leek, and, and not tomato, carrot, the other one. Uh, so, alright, so again, thanks for watching, thanks for following, thanks for sending me your messages, actually appreciate it, big smiles, and if Lynn sees this or my mum, stop blubbing. <laughs> Leave that to me. I nearly did that this morning, you know, but I didn't ail it off. So right, I'll see you, I'll see you later with further updates, uh, probably tomorrow now, obviously. Um if not definitely Friday. Alright, I'll see you soon. Okay. Bye. Finish.